beloved, know peace through these scriptures from your Father in heaven. John 14:27. Peace I leave with you. My peace I give unto you. Not as the world giveth, give I unto you. Let not your heart be troubled, neither let it be fearful. Psalm 37:39. But the salvation of the righteous is from the Lord. He is their strength in the time of trouble. Philippians 4, verses 6 and 7. In nothing be anxious, but in everything by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known unto God. And the peace of God, which passeth all understanding, shall guard your hearts and your thoughts in Christ Jesus. Romans 15.13 now the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing, that you may abound in hope in the power of the Holy Spirit. Micah 7 verse 18b He does not retain his anger forever, because he delights in mercy. Romans 14, 19. So then, let us follow after things which make for peace, and things whereby we may edify one another. Isaiah 26, 3. You will keep him in perfect peace, whose mind is stayed on you, because he trusts in you. John 16.33 These things have I spoken unto you, that in me ye may have peace. In the world ye have tribulation. But be of good cheer. I have overcome the world. Psalm 86 15. But you, O Lord, are a God full of compassion and gracious, long suffering, and abundant in mercy and truth. Isaiah 55 12. For ye shall go out with joy and be led forth with peace. The mountains and the hills shall break forth before you into singing, and all the trees of the fields shall clap their hands. Titus 2, 11 and 12 For the grace of God that brings salvation has appeared to all men, teaching us that denying ungodliness and worldly lusts, we should live soberly, righteously, and godly in the present age. Isaiah 26, 12 O Lord, you will ordain peace for us, for you have indeed done for us all our works. Romans 12, 18. If possible, so far as it depends on you, live peaceably with all. Psalm 119, 165. Great peace have those who love your law. Nothing can make them stumble. Romans 12, 21. Do not be overcome by evil, but overcome evil with good. Isaiah 12.3 Therefore with joy you will 
draw water from the wells of salvation. Colossians 3.15 And let the peace of God rule in your hearts, to which also you were called in one body, and be thankful. Psalm 37.37 Mark the blameless man, and observe the upright, for the future of that man is peace. Psalm 34.14 Depart from evil and do good. Seek peace and pursue it. Isaiah 9.6 For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, and the government shall be upon his shoulder, and his name shall be called Wonderful, Counselor, Mighty God, Everlasting Father, Prince of Peace. Psalm 29.11 May the Lord give strength to his people. May the Lord bless his people with peace. Proverbs 16.7 When a man's ways please the Lord, he makes even his enemies to be at peace with him. Psalm 37.40b He shall deliver them from the wicked and save them because they trust in him. James 3.18 And a harvest of righteousness is sown in peace by those who make peace. 1 Thessalonians 5.15 See that no one repays another evil for evil, but always seek after that which is good for one another and for all people. 1 Peter 5, 7 Casting all your care upon him, for he cares for you. Psalm 136, 1 Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good, for his steadfast love endures forever. Numbers 6 verses 24 through 26. The Lord bless and keep you. The Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Ephesians 2 verses 4 and 5 But God, who is rich in mercy, because of his great love which he loved us, even when we were dead in trespasses, made us alive together with Christ. By grace you have been saved. Psalm 103, verse 8. The Lord is merciful and gracious, slow to anger, and abounding in mercy. Isaiah 54, 10. For the mountains may depart, and the hills be removed, but my loving kindness shall not depart from thee neither shall my covenant of peace be removed, saith Jehovah, that hath mercy on thee. Matthew 6.14 For if you forgive men their trespasses, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. Psalm 37.5 Commit your way to the Lord. Trust also in him, and he shall bring it to pass. 2 Timothy 
1.9 He has saved us and called us to a holy life, not because of anything we have done, but because of His own purpose and grace. His grace was given in Christ Jesus before the beginning of time. Isaiah 30, 18 Therefore the Lord will wait, that He may be gracious to you, and therefore He will be exalted, that He may have mercy on you, for the Lord is a God of justice. Blessed are all those who wait for Him. Romans 3 verses 23 through 24 For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God, being justified freely by His grace through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus. Psalm 90 verse 17 And let the beauty of the Lord our God be upon us and establish the work of our hands for us. Yes, establish the work of our hands. John 3.16 For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only Son that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. Philemon 1.25 The grace of our Lord Christ be with your spirit. Amen. Psalm 37.4 Delight yourself also in the Lord and he shall give you the desires of your heart. Second Chronicles 30 verse 9b For the Lord your God is gracious and compassionate. He will not turn his face from you if you return to him. First Peter 1.13 Therefore, with minds that are alert and fully sober, let your hope on the grace be brought to you when Jesus Christ is revealed at His coming. Psalm 23.6 Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life and I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Romans 5.21 So that as sin reigned in death, even so grace might reign through righteousness to eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Proverbs 28 13. He who covers his sins will not prosper, but whoever confesses and forsakes them will have mercy. Psalm 130 verses 1 and 2. Out of the depths I have cried to you, O Lord. Lord, Hear my voice. Let your ears be attentive to the voice of my supplications. Acts 20.24b My only aim is to finish the race and complete the task the Lord Jesus has given me. The task of testifying to the good news of God's grace. 
Corinthians 12, verses 8 and 9. And he said unto me, My grace is sufficient for you. My strength is made perfect in weakness. Therefore, most gladly, I will rather boast in my infirmities that the power of Christ may rest upon me. Isaiah 2a Behold, God is my salvation. I will trust and not be afraid. For the Lord God is my strength and song, and he has become my salvation. Psalm 89, 14. Righteousness and justice are the foundation of your throne. Mercy and truth go before your face. Beloved, know peace through these scriptures from your Father in heaven. 2 Peter 1 2. Grace and peace be multiplied to you in the knowledge of God and of Jesus our Lord. Isaiah 12 to be the Lord the Lord himself is my strength and defense he has become my salvation Hebrews 4 16 let us therefore come boldly to the throne of grace that we may obtain mercy and find grace to help in time of need. Psalm 85, 8 I will hear what God the Lord will speak, for he will speak peace to his people and to his saints, but let them not turn back to folly. 1 Peter 4.10 As each one has received a gift, minister it to one another as good stewards of the manifold grace of God. Psalm 145.8 The Lord is gracious and full of compassion, slow to anger, and great in mercy. Romans 6.14 For sin shall not have dominion over you, for you are not under law, but under grace. Isaiah 12.5 Sing to the Lord, for he has done excellent things. This is known in all the earth. Psalm 37, 7a Rest in the Lord and wait patiently for him. Micah 7, 19b You will cast all our sins into the depths of the sea. Second Samuel 22:26. With the merciful, you will show yourself merciful. With a blameless man, you will show yourself blameless. Psalm 25:10. All the paths of the Lord are mercy and truth. To such as keep his covenant and his testimonies. Matthew 11, verses 28 through 30. Come unto me, all ye that labor 
and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you, and learn of me, for I am meek and lowly in heart, and ye shall find rest unto your souls. For my yoke is easy, and my burden is light. Micah 718a Who is a God like you, pardoning iniquity and passing over the transgression of the remnant of his heritage? 2 Thessalonians 3.16 Now the Lord of peace himself give you peace at all times in all ways. The Lord be with you all. Psalm 37.11 But the meek shall inherit the earth and shall delight themselves in the abundance of of peace. Deuteronomy 7 9. Therefore know that the Lord your God, He is God, the faithful God, who keeps covenant and mercy for a thousand generations with those who love Him and keep His commandments. Psalm 6-2 Have mercy on me, O Lord, for I am weak. O Lord, heal me, for my bones are troubled. Micah 7-19-A He will again have compassion on us and will subdue our iniquities. Romans 3, verses 23 through 24. For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God, being justified freely by His grace, through the redemption that is in Christ Jesus. James 4, 6 but he gives more grace. Therefore, he says, God resists the proud, but gives grace to the humble. Psalm 145.9 The Lord is good to all, and his tender mercies are over all his works. Lamentations 3, verses 22 and 23. Through the Lord's mercies, we are not consumed, because his compassions fail not. They are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. Luke 6, 36. Therefore be merciful, just, as your Father also is merciful. 2 Corinthians 1.3 Blessed be the God and Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, the Father of mercies and God of all comfort. Psalm 112.4 Unto the upright there arises light in the darkness. He is gracious and full of compassion and righteousness. Micah 6.8 He has shown you, O man, what is good, and what does the Lord require of you? but to do justly, to love mercy, and to walk humbly with your God. 
Matthew 5, 7 Blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy. Ephesians 4, verses 31 and 32 Let all bitterness, wrath, anger, clamor, and evil speaking be put away from you with all malice, and be kind to one another, tender-hearted, forgiving one another, even as God in Christ forgave you. James 3.17 But the wisdom that is above is first pure, then peaceable, gentle, willing to yield, full of mercy and good fruits, without partiality and without hypocrisy. Psalm 5, 7a But as for me, I will come into your house in the multitude of your mercy. 1 John 3, 1a Behold, what manner of love the Father has bestowed on us, that we should be called children of God. Job 37, 14b Stand still and consider the wondrous works of God. Jeremiah 6, 16b Stand in the ways and see, and ask for the old paths, where the good way is, and walk in it. Then you will find rest for your souls. Psalm 91, 4 you can go to him for protection. He will cover you like a bird spreading its wings over its babies. You can trust him to surround and protect you like a shield. 1 Timothy 4.4 4. For everything created by God is good and nothing is to be rejected if it is received with gratitude. Isaiah 51, 15 But I am the Lord your God who divided the sea whose waves roared. The Lord of hosts is his name. Jeremiah 10, 12a he has made the earth by his power. He has established the world by his wisdom. Psalm 37.3 Trust in the Lord and do good. Dwell in the land and feed on his faithfulness. Ephesians 2 Verses 8 and 9. For by grace you have been saved through faith, and not of yourselves. It is the gift of God, not of works, lest anyone should boast. Revelation 22, 21. The grace of the Lord Jesus be with God's people. Amen. Psalm 37, 6 He shall bring forth your righteousness as the light, and your justice as the noonday. Exodus 34, 6 and he passed in front of Moses, proclaiming, The Lord, the Lord, 
the compassionate and gracious God, slow to anger, abounding in love and faithfulness. Psalm 37:18. The Lord knows the days of the upright, and their inheritance shall be forever. Exodus 14:14. 14, 14. You will not have to do anything but stay calm. The Lord will do the fighting for you. Proverbs 12:20. Deceit is in the heart of those who devise evil. But those who have who plan peace have joy.